guys are wondering what my job out if you guys are wondering what I do for a living, I am a cashier at a grocery store. Of course, before that, for a good three, three and a half, four years, I was a courtesy clerk, aka I pushed carts. But of course, once I got sick and tired of everyone being lazy with their job, and I was the only one working, I decided to go inside and become a cashier. But here, right now, I have a list of jobs that I probably would not want or even take responsibility of doing. Let's get started with this bitch. No, 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 no way I can be a mall cop. I'd be the laziest mall cop. I would just sit up here in my booth, like be sitting. I'd be sitting in my booth, like, ugh. ugh. And as I'm laying there, people behind me, I'm sitting there watching Cartoon Network or whatever. Guys behind me walking around with big flat screens, going like, walking. Around like <laughs> Bugs Bunny. <laughs> I'd be like that type of mall cop. Would I be when I was a kid I really wanted to be a real police officer, but from what's been going on with the cops and what white cops have been doing lately, I don't want to take part of it. Last thing I want to do is to get shot because so and so saw me do something. Ain't that right? No way I'm being a cop. I don't know if I could be a teacher. I, I'd probably be most likely be a kindergarten teacher, but I don't know. My ADHD, I get distracted so easily. I'll be sitting there like looking at the window, looking at cars or whatever driving by, and a little kid swallows them little plastic owl scissors or whatever. So I don't know. I, I wouldn't want to be a caregiver for any type of... I wouldn't care for someone else's child. Last thing I wanted to get sued because their kids swallow sprinkles and now they're, they're shitting out glitter for eight months and I'm getting sued and I lose my job now. I, I, I couldn't be a teacher. Especially for no high school. I'll be cussing kids out. Sit your bitch ass down! You know, I, I, I'd cuss high school kids out. You know, especially if you know, you know, back when I was in high school, you know, I used to be, you know, somewhat mean to teachers I didn't really care for. So I, I don't know if I could be a teacher. That shit might come back and bite me in my ass and I don't know. Nah. Not my cup of tea. I could be the president of the United States for a for, uh, number one reason. Um, people would actually vote for me. Like, I'd probably be the first president that has, like, all 100% of the vote. Or at least 99.9% .9 of the vote for the stuff I have planned. But I'll save that for a separate video. And most likely I'd be shot. First day in office. I, Matthew the Funny Man Balint, saw the clock. <laughs> Boom, shot right there. As soon as they swore me in, don't even get it worded. I promise, under God, shot. Nah, 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 nah. I wanted to be a construction worker because I was so good with Legos when I was a kid. You know, I always loved building random ships and buildings and all that. But of course, with my past of Legos, I'm probably gonna fuck up a building because there's gonna be like that one concrete piece I forgot to put in, like the two by two, and you thinking to yourself, well, that's just an extra piece. You throw it away, and you find out it's like crooked looking and all that. That building gonna come tumbling over because I'm gonna be thinking like, oh, this is just an extra brick just in case we need, you know? I, I toss it aside. That whole building would collapse. I get blamed for it. Ain't no way I can be a no construction worker. That's not gonna happen. And I probably fuck around with the machines like that wrecking ball. And I already know, same, I already know, I'm not going to be the only one. People who wanted to be com in construction or like are in construction, since Miley Cyrus' song came out, I know people are right now going, I'm going to be like a rainbow. I'll be singing that and knocking over businesses and all that. I get my ass thrown in jail. Mm -mm. Can't do it. Pinky, I love you, but don't come over here fucking up my tripod. She's scratching herself. Pinky, go in the living room. Pinky, Pinky, go in the living room. Go in the living room. Pinky. No. Pinky, go in the living room. 
talking like she's a person. Pinky, you know, that's white people shit. Pinky, pretty girl. Kitty, kitty, kitty. Because I don't want to be midway through a video and then you end up rubbing your face on my tripod and knocking it over. Yeah, see? Pinky. I'm doing the video right now, dear. This is this is Precious Cat. Her name is Pinky. And no, not like the porn star Pinky. Because she doesn't have she doesn't have a big ol' ass. So she loves me. She likes being near me, especially when I'm doing when I'm editing my videos, she really likes to be next to me. Huh, oh, Pinky. Well, you have to let go of your long claw ass. Yeah. Scooch. Anyway. Y'all, I can't be a baker. I couldn't be anything related to food service. Because a customer's going to piss me off. I'm a pee and shit in your food. Like, I could never work at McDonald's. Unless, like, if I had to, like, had to work at McDonald's, stick me in front of the, I'd be a cashier. Don't let me handle people's food. Because if I were like a cashier and the customer was like, oh, fuck you, I'm missing a french fry. Eh. Then they put me back there and I see that same customer asking for french fries. Best believe I'm going to be like, hmm. Hope you like salty ass. Look all the salt, I put more salt. Stick with the fries. That's the most thing I would do. So don't. That's why I can't be a food service. Because if you fuck with me, I'm a, I'm a spit. I'm a. I'm 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 gonna come to work sick on purpose. I'm I'm a fuck with everybody food. That's why I can't do food service. I I, I can't do it. E, e, Star Starbucks, even though it's just a coffee shop. Starbucks. Oh, can I have a, a caramel macchiato frappuccino piss drinker? I'm like, oh okay, you want piss? I'm a shit in it. Best believe that. Panky, why are you returned? She's such a big cat. Oh, well, bless you. She's sniffing the broom. Well, if you weren't sniffing the broom, okay. stop that. Stop that. She's eating the broom. Stop it. Pink, got to put you in the bathroom until I'm done. Now, yeah, I want a pepperoni pizza with cheesy crust bread. I'm like, yeah, I'm going to shit in that cheesy crust. It's going to be nice and chewy, but it ain't going to be yellow or, or white or whatever. It's going to be all shitty. Mmm, good pizza. Yeah, eating it. Oh, oh, here comes the crust. Oh, shit coming out. Don't fuck with me in food service. That's why I can't do it. I could be a super... I want to be a superhero. I want to be Iron Man. You already know. That's the thing, that... Just like when Tony Stark first got his Iron Man armor, he was fucking around flying. Or in a... What was it? Iron Man, uh... Two, Iron Man three. Whichever ones he was like sitting there shooting wine bottles and drunk and all that. That for that would be me with with my armor or superpowers. I wish I had some superpowers. I wouldn't be saving nobody. I'd be like, ah, save me. I'll be like, I'll be sitting there flying like, oh sorry, I gotta go to work. No, so yeah, I, I couldn't be a I couldn't be a superhero. I couldn't I couldn't yeah I couldn't I couldn't be a driver. No fucking way. No bus driver, no limousine driver, no courtesy driver. Cause let one person say the wrong goddamn thing to me. Let one person say the wrong damn thing to me. Watch how fast I'll drive somewhere else. Think like, oh yeah, can I can I go to um one eight one eight four Carl Street? I drop their ass off on a bridge. Say, all right, here you are. Like, oh, is this it? I'm like, yeah, it is. Right down there. Go ahead. Ah, I bet and drive off or hit him with my car depending how pissed off I am that day, or how pissed off they make me. Let's look, especially if I drive fast and they don't give me a tip, best believe I'm gonna drop my ass back around, run over there, snatch their wallet, and like, give me my three dollars, throw their wallet on the ground, get back in my car and drive off. See, I couldn't be no driver. I'm too angry. Can't do it. Can't do it. If I was a locksmith, I'd <laughs> If I was a locksmith, I wouldn't be unlocking people's door. I'd be breaking into people's houses and shit. I'd be cracking open safes, getting money and shit. I couldn't be no locksmith. That, 
that's just self. That's that's the shortest answer I can give you. Is that I would be breaking and stealing shit. I can't get in my car. No problem, ma'am. Ah, what are you doing? <laughs> I'm locked out of my house. Oh, no problem. Get your shit out of there. <laughs> I break into people's houses. I break into restaurants. Shit, I'm getting. I'm getting. Hey, man, nothing for anybody else. I'd be lock picking all of day. Only at night. I wouldn't do no stupid shit and lock, try to lock pick some in the daytime. That's the thing though, is that if you're a lock, you don't even have to worry about locking your own self out. Like if you lock them in the house, like, oh damn, I forgot my keys, I'm locked out. Shoot, I got my toolbox in my truck. Shoot. You don't even have to worry about having house keys. You can just break in your own house if you're a locksmith. You don't even need to keep no keys with you. You don't have to worry about robbing you or saying like, oh, op open, the, open the door. I can't open the door. I ain't got keys on me. Sorry. My roommate's got it. As soon as they leave. Suckers. You know. Oh, that'd be cool to be a locksmith. I, I, couldn't, I couldn't do that. I can't save nobody's life. I mean, if I save someone's life, cool, because I've taken CPR classes. So, you know, I know CPR. I know the Heimlich. You know, I know all that. I was certified a few years back. But... You know, I, I couldn't be full-blown ambulance or doctor. Hell no, I couldn't be performing no surgery because no, my clumsy ass. I'd be like, all right, we're making the surgery. Like a drop of sweat ends up in their heart and they die instantly. I'd kill people if I was a damn surgeon. I couldn't do that. And you got to have steady hands and all that. And I got ADD, ADHD. My hands will be all over the goddamn place. I'll be like, ooh, look at this sharp thing. Eee! Time to death. Can't do it. Couldn't drive no ambulance either. I'd be all over the fucking road. I'd be so quick, like, oh, I gotta hurry to take this guy to the hospital. I'd be hitting him with speed bumps, going, Doosh. boom, dude, die before you even get in the damn hospital. Can't do it. I would love to save a life if I could, or given the opportunity. I, I can't. I can't trust myself in someone else's life though. Not nothing that serious, anyway. If I had to take someone to a hospital, you know, I saw. Someone that's bleeding to death, I'll be like, okay, get in my car, go to the hospital, you know, something like that. But if I was like a licensed doctor or whatever, no, I couldn't do it. Couldn't do it. Then the family would try to sue me. Nah, can't do it. Well, if there's a list of jobs that you guys think you couldn't do, let me in the let me know in the comments on on why you couldn't get in or anything. Or hey, if you guys got some jobs, uh, ask me if you know if I could do them. You know, I'll let you guys know in the comments too. Please subscribe, like, and share the video, and I will see you guys next video.